Uh, golden ticket. Feel the thunder, golden ticket. Feel it, feel it, feel it. Okay, now let's turn this baby on. What's up? I'm Tyler here and I'm back with another video today. I'm reacting to the Golden Ticket Awards. I am so nervous. Oh, uh, I know this list is going to be terrible, so I'm just going to search up. Search it up right now really quick. Guys, before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way you won't miss any new videos that I have posted. So, before I take too long, I just really would like to get into this so we're gonna start with top 2019 top steel and we're at the bottom of the list 49 what tatsu and goliath at magic mountain tie that is actually stupid okay for another time 47 superman ride of steel wow at six flags america that is really high whoa and leesburg Manon. that is so high Dude, it looks good, but like not that good. Okay, Raging Bullet 46, that's really high. But, you know, I can see it being there. Full throttle, that should not be anywhere near this. Whoa, Wizard! What is Wizard doing on this list? Black Mamba, okay. That's actually not that bad of a spot, you know? I, I could put it, I would put it higher maybe, but, you know, it's good. Whoa, Steel Curtain, that's actually it's actually like a really good spot. I'm not even gonna lie. Let's go. Cannibal made it on the list and not in a terrible spot either. So that so why why is Kumba at 40? That is really really low. Wicked Cyclone at 39. That is low. For Bolton above Wicked Cyclone. What? Why is Twisted Timbers at 37? Gina Hunt above Twisted Timbers! Dude, how high were you, Golden Ticket, when you made this list? Tron Light Cycle Power Run. Okay, I'm not even gonna say anything about that. Whoa, Yukon Striker is in the top. That is so high. Banshee above Yukon Striker. Thank you. Somebody who puts Alpengeist really high. However, that is so freaking high. Montu at 30 as a tie. With Goliath and over Georgia. Dude, those both ranked really high, and I'm actually really happy about that. That's really, really good. I'm also happy. <laughs> That's really good. And then next is Behemoth. Are you actually okay? Intimidator Carowinds? Intimidator should not be right here. Skyrush isn't even top 25. That should be top 5. That should, yeah, Skyrush should be top 5. It's not even on here. New Texas Giant at 26. Above Skyrush, though. <laughs> New Texas Giant is really good, but above Skyrush. You put. Okay. You just put Mind Bender. Mind Bender at Six Flags Over Georgia, one of the most overrated looking coasters on earth, above New Texas Giant. Where did I put my belt? 23X2. That's actually a tiny bit low. I would put that like more in spot higher. Tie with Blue Fire. <laughs> That's really interesting. So I have nothing to say about that. That's. Interesting. Whoa! Oh look, I have the other half. The cardboard. Mm. <sighs> Ty 
time traveler should not be on this list, or that high. Top throw dragster is 21. That's unbelievably high. Get out. Still dragon 2000. Dude, that should not even be top 100 in the world. Get out. Get that out of here. Okay, Helix at 19. That's not that bad. Magnum at 18? That's so high. Dude, what were they thinking? What were they? Turn at 17. Let's just move on. Nem wow, Nemesis at all. And Towers is at 16. Wow. That's actually sad because let me tell you that is not 16. It's definitely top 15. Not 16. No worries. Mako, that's a little hot. But you know, it looks so good. That flooring though. Oh my god. You have Diamond Back at King's Island. Diamond Back at King's Island above. Uh, you have Diamond Back at King's Island above. Game like. <clears throat> Mako. The best. No, second best being it. Maverick at Cedar Point. That's a good spot. Ah, uh, a little higher. Colton's gonna be really mad at that. Phantom's Revenge. That is the exact spot I have Phantom's Revenge. That's actually a really amazing spot in my opinion. And then I throw 5 of 11. That's also an amazing spot. I'm one of the couple of enthusiasts in the world that think I throw 5 is really, really overrated. And. Okay, I'm just gonna. Work. Ah, oh. uh, golden ticket. Feel the thunder, golden ticket. Feel it. Feel it. Feel it. <laughs> Nitro should not be anywhere near the top 100. Leviathan. That should definitely be on this list, but nowhere near that high. Oh my gosh, that is so... Apollo's Chariot at 8. You actually... Apollo's <sighs> Chariot is so hot. That is so... Iron or Irat? Okay, that's a pretty good spot for Irat. I'm not gonna lie. You have... Twisted Colossus above one of the best RMCs. Nope. I'm out. I'm done. G Force at five. G Force at five. Superman the Rye. I know they love ranking this high, but dude, is that high. <sighs> you know how mad I am that Untamed and Zedra have not been on this list or a hockey game. Or Storm Chaser for that matter, or Lightning Run. Yeah. Or either of the Raptors. Yeah. Uh, let me guess. Steel Vengeance is gonna be three again. Volume Force is gonna be two, and Fury's gonna be one. And look at that, at number three, we have Steel Vengeance. Look, that's a respectable opinion to not have Steel Vengeance at number one. And I'm happy they don't have Steel Vengeance at number one. When it's only Steel Coasters, it should be number one. That Millennium Force at number two. Ah, golden ticket. You just love your Millennium Force. Don't, you? don't have much to say about that one since I knew it was going to be since it's for the Golden Ticket. And look at that, at number one we have Fury 325. Look, Fury 
looks good and all, but not anywhere like that. So now we are going to start with Mr. Sunbow. And at number... <laughs> Get this. Grizzly. At King's Dominion. Hey, at least it's not Grizzly at... Switchback and ZDTs, you know, I can see that. Switchback, I've heard it's really good. It has some really good air time, it's pretty underrated. Twister and Grown Alarm. I don't know much about Twister and Grown Alarm, so I'm assuming it's good since it's on here, but I'm assuming it's a bad spot. Yeah. El Toro and Rise. Yeah, I don't know how to pretty say that, but that El Toro, uh, that could be off this I can see that being off. Twister at Kenobles. I'm gonna say that that should not be on here. Tied with Rouge Banan at Tivoli Gardens. I don't know much about that one. Megaphobia. I don't know about that one either. Sorry guys, I really don't know what I'm about to use. Hey Mr. 60, that is so low. Hey Mr. 60, that is so low. What do you mean? It is Another person that thinks screaming is 50 in the world. Look, Jay, now you have some friends. I have some friends who agree with you on Screaming Eagle. You have a family GCI about Screaming Eagle. Now that is twisted. How is Invader above Screaming Eagle? Should get Coney at Park? Coney at Park. Ooh, I don't know. That's interesting. American Thunder. I'm just gonna say that's good. I'm not sure about that. Blue Streak at Cedar Point at 38. Okay, look, I know that you... <sighs> How is Blue Street? Golden ticket, I have a I weapon. I'm not afraid to use it. Freaking get Blue Street so out of here. Coney Lake Park, Blue Street. I don't know, but Blue Street can see her point. Get that out of here. Diddy Express at 37. Diddy Express at 37. Dude, that is so high or low. Boss. Boss at St. Louis. Boss at 65 St. Louis. Nope, we're just gonna move on. Choo cha a uh, lane. I don't know. That coaster, sorry guys. Rampage in Alabama Adventure. I've never heard of that one either. Flying turns wow, flying turns the canoe that should not be on here. Playland wooden coaster? A coaster at Peanut Playland. That is really low to be honest. That should be so much higher. I mean I'm one of the people who thinks it's like not as good, but still it looks so good. Boardwalk Bullet at 31. That's interesting because I've heard some people who have said it's like top tier movie, but I might be writing it this uh, this next year though, so. Colossus? At Heidi Park. Don't make me. Don't oh, that's gonna be thumbnail right there. Okay, that's gonna be thumbnail. <laughs> Don't let me drown. Do I need to take out Mjolnir again? 
Prowler runs a fun between them. You have Coney Island Cyclone on here. What is that doing on here? What is Coney Island Cyclone doing on this list? What? Goliath and Six Flags is Great America. That's not a bad spot for movies. Legend at Holiday World at 26. I'm not sure what I think about that one. Troy and Toby 25. Eh. I don't know. Renegade. That's so high. Wodan, dude. Wodan looks good. 23 and Wodan goes through. I can see that. I can see that. White Lightning above Wodan? Freaking Renegade? And Go Goliath? Above. I'm literally gonna lose all my hair up here. Whoa, raising the holiday world. I'll just say I can see that because I want to move on. Jackrabbit, I can you No, calm and great escape. <laughs> 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 Thunderbolt at Kennywood. I actually don't know much about Thunderbolt at Kennywood. Heard of it, but like, Giant Dipper, what? No. Wildfire isn't top five. Wildfire isn't top five. Wildfire is not top five. That is. <sighs> Shivering Timbers at Michigan's Adventure beat Wildfire for number 15. These are a Lightning Racer or Hershey Park. You know, I, I can't see that in any way. One side of me, other side says that that's actually not that bad of a spot. So, Alter at Leesburg. Not a terrible spot. Gold Striker at California's Great America. 12, bro. That's so high. Thunder at Dollywood, bro. That's, again, really, really high. Mystic Timbers, number 10, bro. I think that's actually a really good spot. Mystic Timbers looks like one of the best winnies in the world, in my opinion. Top 10 for sure. Ravine Flyer 2. I don't think this looks better than Mystic Timbers. However, this is actually not too bad of a spot. I think they should put it a couple spots lower, but. Acceptable. Outlaw Run at number 8. You know what I think about that? Oh, you don't want to know. Trust me. Just trust me. You have Lightning Rod not at number 1. You go striker above it. Wow, that is actually trash. Oh. Come on, we only are work. Beast should not be on this list at all. No, it should not be on this. Hey, snake friend. Look, I know that. Just, just choke me. Okay, that was not actually a very good joke. Okay, that was not good. Look at that. Lightning rod isn't number one. El Toro should be, and guess what isn't number one? El Toro, because it is number three. What the frick? You thought I was gonna cuss there, didn't ya? But you know this is a family-friendly channel. Oh my gosh, that's so cringe. But El Toro, man, that should be number one if Lightning Rod isn't, which it isn't, and look at that, Voyager Holiday World number two, that is Okay, look, Voyage looks like one of the most overrated coasters on Earth. Top 10 for sure. Ah, Phoenix. Akinobles number one. I mean, I, I, 
I expected it, but at the same time, at the same time, sorry Snake, I just have to, yeah, anger, buddy, Oh, frick. <laughs> Phoenix at number one. Nope, I give up. So guys, that's gonna be it for this reaction. I really hope you enjoy it. I feel like this is one of my best, except for the fact that I'm not screaming the whole time. <gasps> like normal. I'm not really in the mood to scream today. Plus, I mean, it's Sunday. I feel chill today, so I don't wanna scream, but like, that was probably, there were some spots that I was honestly surprised weren't that bad, and others. <laughs> I mean, it happens. Most lists get a couple things wrong, but a lot of stuff right. This list got a lot of stuff wrong, but a couple stuff right. I think Goliath at SFOG was actually a really, really good spot. So, that's just one example. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like down below. Give me a comment on what your favorite part of the reaction was and what you are the most surprised about and what you think should be changed the most. I feel like Lightning Rod should be number one, obviously, because I'm a little bit of a Lightning Rod fanboy. I might be writing it this summer, so I just realized that's not on topic. Anyways, guys, I have a couple really quick updates. So, a couple updates. I just, I'm not, I'm actually retarded. Okay. So, I might be going to Fiesta, Texas on the 21st for a Texas Thrill Seekers event. Um, it's during Fright Fest and you get a bunch of tours and stuff. There's ERT from 10.30 to midnight. Um, there's a bunch of haunted house and stuff. I've never been to Fright Fest before. It'll be a, be a brave challenge and I'm super duper excited. I'm not 100% going. But because of this, I will also be having a Facebook page. So I will link that in the description once I get it. But I don't think I have it yet. I will have it yet at least. So guys, also, another update. I might be going to Six Flags Over Texas for my birthday. And if so, I will be hosting a meetup for anyone that wants to come. It'll most likely be on, I think, the 14th. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be... Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing, amazing day. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Peace. My little pony! My little pony! Ah! My little pony! Ah! I used to wander walk by Jeff Country! My little pony! That's what you're all shouting at, that's a great thing! Big adventure! Tons of fun! A beautiful heart, faithful and strong! Sharing kindness! It's an easy feat! And magic makes it all complete! Yeah! My little pony! Do you know you are my best?